Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to my very first episode. My name is Will and this is the start of my van life journey. During the last four to six months, I've watched a ton of YouTubers and I fantasized about the van life experience. I loved how they were free and I loved how they were traveling all over the place inside of their vans and had everything inside of it without needing anything else. And I figured after some time that for someone like me who's an internet entrepreneur, the nomadic lifestyle of traveling from place to place and seeing different parts of the country would benefit me. And I guess the added benefit of that would be to also save some money and do some traveling at the same time. So here we are. So in the last couple of years, I've tried everything I could to be as minimalist as I can. I don't spend a lot of money and I don't buy a lot of things that I don't need. I thought about this whole van life thing long and hard for like the last three to four months. And as a result of that, I recently sold my Porsche 911 and I bought this van. Also earlier this year, I was interested in buying a home. I went down to Texas to see what the real estate property was gonna be like. And unfortunately it was super expensive and I decided to come back home empty handed. And just recently I moved to Orange County. So I started to rent another apartment and I'm pretty much a minimalist. So I think this van life thing could possibly work out. So you might be wondering why I'm doing van life. The main reasons why I'm doing van life is because I'm sort of bored and sort of jaded with life. I moved to San Diego four and a half years ago uh, from New York City and I absolutely loved San Diego. But about uh, a couple of months ago, I moved to Orange County and I don't think it was the right move for me. I think I made a mistake by coming to Orange County. I just don't enjoy it as much. It's not something that I want to continue doing. So I thought about moving back to San Diego and yeah, San Diego is awesome. I think I definitely want to stay in San Diego, San Diego, even though I want to do van life still. And I feel that I can try van life and I can travel a little bit and enjoy myself. I have a dog with me, so he's going to be traveling with me as well. And I think we're going to have a good time doing this. Inside the van, there's a lot of space, as you can see. And out of all the small little vans out there, I think the Promaster City's probably got the most amount of space inside of it. The other main deciding factor for getting this van was because of the Cascade Camper build. I wanted to get the Cascade Camper because it offers all the amenities that I needed, such as a sink, running water with a fuel pump, as well as electricity, solar panel, and uh, a refrigerator and of course bedding. So those are all the essentials that I needed. And in a tiny little space like this, I don't really need much else except for that. The van isn't necessarily a luxury van, as you can see, there's really nothing there. It does have a backup camera and cruise control. And I think that's about it. Um, as far as the seats are concerned, they're super comfortable. And believe it or not, I don't miss my Porsche. <laughs> I know it's so weird to say that, but I don't miss my Porsche and I just can't wait to start living inside of this little van. So this is something that is both very exciting and kind of terrifying for me. As you may realize, I've never lived inside of a car before. I've never lived inside of a motor home before. I have no idea what to expect. I've never even lived inside of this van. So this journey for me is something that's gonna be absolutely brand new. I have no idea what I'm doing and I don't even know if I'm gonna like it. So I hope that you join me on my journey. I hope that you give this video a like so this way other people can see it as well. And I hope that you can subscribe to my channel so this way I can keep producing these types of contents for you guys because you're gonna see all the good and all the bad in my videos. I'm gonna reveal everything to you and I'm gonna take you step by step through the process of me moving into this van full time. The current plan right now is to move into the van as of November 1st. I'm selling everything from my apartment and I'm moving out of my apartment at the end of October. So this is a brand new journey for me. Join me for the ride and I would love to have you guys come aboard. Until the next episode, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Take care, ciao for now.